A candidates vying for the Bibb County Board of Elections. Board of Education seat eight post have eight days until the election they say could play a big role in the direction of the school district. 41 NBC's Joy Dukes caught up with both candidates to discuss their platforms. Longtime educator Lisa Garrett is running against current seat holder Dr. Wanda West for the post eight Bibb County Board of Education seat. I really wanted to run because in my years with Bibb County, I've sort of been all over the county. I've been in North Macon, I've been in East Macon, I've been in Sub-South, I've been um, in the inner city area. Garrett says after 34 years with the district, she's ready to take on the challenges of making tough decisions to move the county forward. I want to look for waste, if there's any waste in the budget, um, to make sure that we're getting all of the money in the classroom that needs to be in the classroom. Um, I want to look at lowering class sizes. Garrett's biggest priority is advocating for special needs children. I want to make sure that we're getting them the best education. Dr. Wanda West says during her eight years serving on the board, the school district has seen a lot of positive change and improvements. We worked very hard to be able to say that our graduation rate has gone from 58.9% to 77.1 percent. Creation of programs like the Leader and Me and another program to monitor the board's efficiency and policies. We're actually teaching young people and teachers leadership skills. West says she's not done yet. Her next priorities, if reelected, are addressing bullying, advocating for metal detectors in schools, and finding ways to fight the issue of failing schools. If children cannot read, they cannot learn. That's why I want the predominance of our time spent on making sure that we have uh, as many in reading endorsed and math endorsed and gifted endorsed and exceptional children's endorsement as possible. With just eight days until the post eight election, it's up to voters to make their pick for the position. In Macon, Joy Dukes, 41 NBC News. Well, early voters have until May 20th to cast their votes before Election Day. Polls will reopen on May 22nd.